a word that brings fear into the people who hear it. A disease that has affected many lives globally and close to 10,000 lives in India. The coronavirus. Contrary to its complexities, it has a very simple structure. An envelope enclosing RNA and nucleoprotein. The envelope also consists of spike, membrane and envelope proteins along with some accessory proteins. We will be focusing on the spike protein, which is the major surface protein that is used to bind to the angiotensin converting enzyme to a receptor. This permits the viral membrane to fuse with the human cell membrane, allowing the virus entry. The S protein also needs to be cleaved by cellular proteases, which is done by the TMPRSS2 receptor therefore preventing attachment and fusion prevents entry. If we were to take just this protein and introduce it into the body, we can observe an immunogenic response without an actual infection, which brings me to my proposal, nanoparticle vaccines. They use nanoscale materials such as virus-like particles, liposomes and immune stimulating complexes as delivery vehicles for vaccine antigens. They hold many advantages over conventional vaccine methods and have no risk of infection. They can also be prepared from biodegradable materials like polysaccharides and polyamino acids. The multivalent interactions by nanoparticles promote receptor-mediated endocytosis and enhance binding of immune factors and complement. They therefore provide a novel prospect in the current scenario.